Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to restart the explorer.exe process in Windows 10. Most of the avenues I'm going to be going through in this tutorial will be available to users of Windows 7 and Windows 8 as well. So while explorer.exe is a very useful and critical process to the Windows operating system, there could be a lot of issues that could be caused by it and sometimes it's sometimes better just to restart or refresh your explorer.exe file. So let's say for example that your computer is crashing and an end task has been issued and basically you'll lose most of your taskbar and the background of your desktop might be blue or black or just a random color and then all you see is your mouse around on the screen that would be a sign that explorer.exe has crashed or has stopped responding. So in this tutorial I'll be going over a few different ways to get explorer.exe back up and running. So the first way to do it and if you have access to your taskbar would be to right click on your taskbar and left click on task manager. You want to make sure you're underneath the more detail section. should be listed underneath Windows Processes here and we see it says Windows Explorer so what you want to do is just left click on it and then on the bottom right side of the window it says restart so left click on that you see how appears the taskbar and everything is being refreshed that is a sign that explorer.exe is being restarted You could also right click on the process and then left click on restart and that will also restart Explorer.exe. You could also right click on Explorer.exe and then end task and then if you went up to the top of the task manager and then left click on file and then left click on run new task you can actually type in Explorer. You don't even have to type in .exe you can just type in Explorer and then left click on OK and Explorer will start back up. Another way to do it is if you do not have access to your taskbar, what you can do is hold down the Control Alt Delete key. So let's say for example that our Explorer.exe is completely crashed here. So I'm going to end the task. So now without access to a taskbar, what we're going to do is click on Control alt delete and then we'll have the option to load the task manager right here. So just left click on task manager. And at that point you could just go up again to the file tab at the top and then left click on run new task, type in explore, left click on OK. And it should be good to go. I can't tell you guys how many times I've used this on um, a fairly regular basis. So it's very useful to know how to do it and you don't have to restart your computer or anything. And hopefully in most cases you don't lose any data or files or process or programs that you had open on your computer. So you don't lose any unsaved data. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys out and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.